How long will you be single for? Love Personality Test Are you single and looking for love? It can feel like torture at times. And you've probably asked yourself this question, when will I finally find my other half? No heartbreaks or drama, just someone to love and cherish for good. This simple test will help you get the answer to that burning question. You'll have three options to choose from for each question. Just go with your gut and don't overthink it. 1. When you meet someone new and you like them, what do you do? A. I approach them and try to find some common ground. B. I get more active and hope they notice me. C. Hmm. Nothing. What am I supposed to do? If you chose option A, you get 20 points, B is worth 30 points, and C is 10. 2. What do you normally have for dinner? A. Cooking is my passion, so I make something myself. I can't wait to start my own family and cook for them. B. I eat out with friends or family. This way, we all have a great time and no one has to cook for everyone. C. I get a takeout or order pizza or something. Why slave all evening when you can get whatever you want delivered to you? Reward yourself with 30 points if you love to cook. If you're a fan of eating out, you just got 20 points. Those who are for takeouts get 10 points. 3. Do you prefer cats or dogs? A. Dogs for life. They're loyal, active, and friends for life. B. I'm totally a cat person. Can't say no to those purring balls of fur. C. Something more exotic. A raccoon, maybe? I want a pet to share extensively online and get all the attention and likes. Dog people get 20 points, cat lovers earn 30 points, and 10 points go to those who love more exotic pets. 4. Which of the following sounds like a perfect Friday night? A. A movie night at home. I love to have some cozy time with my family. B. Arts night at the theater or museum. What better way to spend a Friday than to learn something new? C. Party hard all night. You only live once, you know, and Friday is the best day to live life to the fullest. If you prefer to stay at home, you get 30 points. Art lovers score a 20, and party animals get 10 points. 5. What kind of movies do you love the most? A. Action thrillers. I miss that thrill in real life, so I can at least get it from the screen. B. Drama documentary. Real life and heartbreaking stories that make you think and learn something new are the best. C. Comedy cartoons. I only watch things the whole family can enjoy. If you prefer the thrill, add 10 points to your score. If you love true stories, grab 20 points. Comedy fans get 30 points. 6. 
Do you get jealous easily over your friends or in past relationships? A. Yes, mine is mine and no one else's. B. No, relationships are based on trust. Even my closest friends aren't my property in any way. C. I do, but I never show it. Let it bother me, not others. Option A is worth 10 points, B will add 30 points to your final score, and C is a 20-point option. 7. Do you have any siblings? A. No, I'm an only child. Frankly speaking, I'm happy that I got all the attention. B. My sibling is my best friend. C. I come from a huge family, and I'm one of the elder siblings. I grew up taking care of my younger siblings. They might be noisy, but I can't imagine my life without them. It's all simple with this one. 10 points for an A, 20 for a B, and 30 for a C. 8. Describe your perfect other half. A. Smart and sexy, sometimes sarcastic. B. Funny and cute, sometimes shy. C. Free spirit, sometimes pretty crazy. Did you pick option A? Then grab your 20 points. You can add 30 points for option B and 10 points for option C. 9. Imagine you have already found love. Will you let the world know? A. Yeah, Facebook, Instagram, that's the point. B. Nope, I like to keep such things private. C. Perhaps I'll post a picture a few months into the relationship. In case you went for option A, you've earned 10 points, B is worth 20 points, and C is worth 30 points. 10. What would you never do for your special someone? A. Leave my job and move elsewhere. Stability and my own income are important. B. Fight with my family. If they don't like that special someone of mine, maybe it's a sign to reconsider how special they really are. C. Give up my hobbies. A relationship isn't a reason to give up something I enjoy and something that's let me learn and grow. Did you pick option A? Then you just got 20 points. B gives you 30 points, and C is worth 10 points. We're done with the questions, so add up your scores. If you scored 100 to 160 points, you're going to be single for another year or so. Maybe you're just not ready for a serious commitment. Enjoy this time as a free spirit. Learn new things, travel the world, and meet new people. One of those roads should take you directly into the arms of your special someone. It'll just take some time. Those whose final result is 170 to 230 points will stop going solo in the next six to nine months. You're an outgoing and fun individual who doesn't mind settling down, but doesn't like to rush things. Your significant other is out there, and maybe they share one of your many hobbies. 
Did you get over 230 points? Congrats! Your love is right around the corner. Are you ready for it? Judging by the fact that you're a sweet and loving person who enjoys taking care of others, it looks like you're totally ready. You can't wait to share all the special moments with a very special person who's about to walk into your life.